Mastering Polite Offers, The Magic of Would You Like? Hello, language learners. Today we're going to delve into an important part of English language communication, making polite offers. This can be critical when interacting with others in a variety of situations, from everyday encounters to more formal settings. The key phrase we'll explore today is, would you like? This phrase is a powerful tool in your English-speaking toolkit and can significantly help you sound more natural and polite in your interactions. Before we dive in, let's understand what would you like really means. It's a phrase we use to extend an offer to someone or ask them if they want something. It's a polite and friendly way to extend an invitation or propose an action which can be anything from offering a cup of tea to suggesting a meeting at a specific time. Here's an example. Would you like some more coffee? Would you like to go for a walk in the park? Note that, would you like, is more polite than simply asking, do you want? Now, let's look at different contexts where you can use this phrase. Offering food or drink. It's very common to use, would you like, when offering food or drink to someone. For instance, would you like a piece of cake? Would you like another drink? Inviting or suggesting activities. You can also use, would you like, when suggesting or inviting someone to do something. Would you like to join us for dinner tonight? Would you like to visit the museum this weekend? At work or in formal situations, in more formal or work-related situations, would you like, can be used to arrange meetings or other tasks. Would you like to schedule a meeting for next week? Would you like me to handle this task? Knowing how to use, would you like, is important, but it's equally important to know how to respond to it. You can simply say, yes, please, if you accept the offer, or, no, thank you, if you want to decline. If you need to give a more complex answer, you can follow these with a reason or an explanation. Yes, please, I'd love to have some more coffee. No, thank you, I'm full. Well, there you have it, the magic of, would you like? It's a very polite and versatile phrase perfect for making offers in a wide range of situations. Remember, using this phrase not only improves your English communication but also helps you sound more polite and respectful. We hope you found this lesson helpful. Don't forget to practice. As always, keep learning, keep exploring, and I'll see you in our next lesson. Happy learning!